Somebody could be in regret. Spirit says they're in regret. We got married too soon. Okay, so you are in regret. Somebody's in regret because they married somebody too soon before they possibly really knew them. You guys could have rushed to get married. Nine of Swords. Somebody's nervous, worried. Knight of Wands. This could be something with travel. Somebody could be nervous about something with travel or somebody leaving. Somebody's also nervous because they see you walking in like a more confident, comfortable energy. You're more comfortable with yourself. You're believing in yourself more. You're more courageous. You're more brave. You're more headstrong. They can be worried about your power or your, they feel like you're powerful or something. You got married to somebody before you really got to know them or something like that. Oh, you're ending that now. Death. Chariot, you're ending something and going in a new direction. Ace of Pentacles, you could be having some kind of new offer, new opportunity, new investment, new money. Or you're about to go plant a seed somewhere else. This could be with another person or something new. Somebody's about to definitely travel. You're about to sever ties, so maybe this is a divorce. For some of you guys, Spirit's telling me something like you guys only spent like two weeks together before you guys got married or something. Judgment. Yeah, you're making a final decision. Final judgment call. Some truth be could be coming out. Somebody could be having a revelation. You're going down a new path. Ten of Cups. You could have a family dynamic or this is something of all the relatives, family. Your relatives could be uh, helping you with the situation. You possibly have kids with some with this person. They're finding out just who they really are. Queen of Cups reverse. That's what I'm hearing. They're finding out who they really are. Queen of Cups reverse to a Cups reverse. You guys are about to divorce or separate. You're you're dealing with somebody that's sad, emotional. They could be cold. This could be somebody that was doing dark energy work on you, emotionally manipulating you. This person, um, I feel like is cold or something. They're not. They don't show you much love, and if they do, it's fake. It's love bombing. There could be some kind of trust issues or some tension between you guys. I just heard the biggest mistake of their life. Yeah, two of swords reversed. You made up your mind already. You made a decision. Strength. They see you in this confident energy. That's what I'm saying. They're trying to keep you like insecure and stuff on purpose. So like you don't have confidence to move on or to go pursue someone else or to like move forward in life, maybe with career opportunities. They don't want you having no self-belief. They don't want you having courage to walk away. This is our biggest nightmare is what I'm hearing. Four of Wands reversed. Justice reversed. Knights of Cups reversed. There's possibly infidelity or there's getting ready to be. 
things are off balance between you guys. There's no, uh, it could be one sided, there's no compromise. Somebody's being dishonest. They're not genuine. They don't have genuine true feelings for you. They're playing you and stuff, love bombing. You possibly fell out of love with them or you're not in love with them. They're not in love with you. I'm just going to tell you straight up. I'm just going to tell you straight up. This person's not in love with you. It's phony or something. Wow. Somebody's in despair over a wealthy man. This person could be just all about your money. This person only sees dollar signs with you. That's it. They know you're about to leave them out in the cold. This could be somebody that's going to have to get a job. They definitely, they definitely do dark work over you or pay for dark work. You could have been noticing like your confidence was was this person was messing with your confidence or you was feeling less worthy you was feeling more insecure as time went on reservations desire worth extravagance you're learning to love yourself more i feel like you're definitely moving in another direction this could be something about a car or a vehicle commitment reverse just came out you're not committed no more You're possibly ending a contract or obviously looks like a divorce. For some of you guys, I'm hearing something. They're never home. So they're never home or something. Someone's never home. They're trying to keep you in a fog. They could be sending you mixed signals or vice versa. You're sending them mixed signals, blocked emotions, or you feel like you messed up. This person, I feel like, is trying to make you feel like you guys are in love, but you're not. They, it's like emotional manipulation. They're going through an emotional storm and lusting reverse. They was possibly trying to seduce you a lot trying to place lustful uh i'm seeing somebody that was trying to place like lustful magic over you to get you to marry them you was possibly infatuated with them sexual energy they may be emotionally unstable turmoil unstable affected it's a queen of cups reverse energy They could have pressured you to marry them. You made a mistake marrying this person is what you're realizing. Visit reversed. Okay, you cannot be visiting them or, or somebody's not visiting. Some of you guys are worried. If you have kids, you're possibly worried like if you guys separate divorce that they're not going to let you see kids or something with visitation rights. Marriage reverse. You guys are divorcing. Yeah. Somebody's stuck in a sadness energy. And there's possibly infidelity, fidelity reversed. So show us this queen of cups reverse. This person is sad, possibly a feminine. The tower. Knights of Pentacles reverse. They are going through a tower. They're seeing that you're realizing something. They're seeing you're getting woke. They realize that, like, you're not going to be committed to them no more. This is somebody 
that they was doing magic, slowing you down, like playing on your emotions, your feelings. They're affecting your job or work somehow for some of you guys. It's like a, they're affecting your confidence. Magician reverse. They've been doing magic over you. This So this is, must be a spouse doing magic over you. They're purposely trying to manipulate you. Something with your confidence, but you're realizing it's affecting your job or like your confidence at work maybe or something with your business because they're an empress reverse because they're insecure they can't have it they can't have it both ways they want you to be wealthy and stable but then they don't want it's just like it doesn't work like that eight of cups reverse they're feeling very insecure about you insecure about you moving on or Maybe seeing somebody else or cheating and stuff. You're not committed no more. You're about to leave them out in the Five of Pentacles. Five of Pentacles, Devil, Ten of Cups, Reverse. You guys could be breaking up a family dynamic. Could be kids. There's too much insecurity. Somebody's depressed. This person's possibly about to be struggling financially. Once you guys move on or something. They may not be getting alimony. You possibly gonna be paying child support though for some of you guys. Yeah, this person does witchcraft over you. Some insecure spouse does witchcraft over you. You're finding out about. Yeah, they're in, they're unhappy. Nine of Cups reverse and you're unhappy with them. You guys are possibly both unhappy. They're trying to keep you in the chariot reverse, not moving forward, not being too successful, not being too confident, not too, yeah, that's not good. It's causing them to lose sleep. What is this Ace of Pentacles? Queen of Wands. You could have some kind of newfound confidence or this could be somebody new. You could be meeting somebody new that's um, somebody new. This doesn't even have to be romantic. This could be like a companion, a friend you're meeting. There's somebody new in your life possibly helping you or something like that or supporting you. Somebody's bringing some kind of positivity to your life and I feel like they could be giving you some kind of advice. They're trying to like cheer you on or support you or help you feel more. Uh, they're trying to empower you is what I'm sensing. Yeah, Knight of Wands. They're trying to have you, Knight of Wands, Will of Fortune. They're trying to have you, they want you to feel good about yourself. They want you to possibly move on from whoever this is they could be teaching you something you could be learning something from them they're helping you make some kind of changes they're helping they're helping you expand and grow this could be a sagittarius aries leo it could be a pisces i'm sorry but you need to leave this spouse behind they could be riding on your coattails that's what i'm hearing that's for some of you guys judgment yeah you're making a decision right now final judgment call you're not going to be moving forward with this spouse or partner you're getting guarded towards them nine of wands you're getting guarded towards them and then they're having a problem with like your your you empowering yourself your self-belief your uh strength you you got married to this person too soon or too impulsively or they, they, they manipulated you or used magic to get you to marry them, it seems like. Yeah, Ace of Swords, Four Swords Reverse. They're, they're, right now, they're stressed out. They're stressed. 